got it all out. And to help you with that, here's lucky ticket number seven. Take it. With that, you can play Pirate's Rampage and Card Carnival. But not all by your lonesome. Your number's the same as someone else's. Ooh. Find them, and you've got yourself a team. Work together, master the games, and you'll earn companion cards. <laughs> you can turn those in for beachwear. And once you're dressed to impress, you'll finally be ready to hit the beach. Right? right? So start searching and let the fun begin. Best of luck finding that special someone. <laughs> Hang <Hey>, loose! <laughs> High seas and hey, got a ticket for this thing called Costa Del Amor. Don't know what it is, but it's happening here, so it's a special event for uh, meeting new people. But looks like you and me got paired up. Wait, what? Why do you care about meeting new people? For the companion cards. What do we have here? Looks like it's right up my alley. Whoa, hold on there. You use firearms for a living, don't you? Sorry, but I can't allow you to play this game. Amateurs only. That's our policy. Oh, it is, is it? Why didn't you speak up sooner? I don't see any signs either. This is false advertising. You know that. I'll do it. <sighs> Just don't embarrass us. Da, 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 da. Hey, that's nothing to sneeze at. Well done, gentlemen. With play like that, you must have known each other for years. The shooting and the shouting was a sight to behold. <laughs> you hear that? A sight to behold. It's his job to butter us up. Oh, come on, man. Just drop the jaded act for a minute and take the compliment. I promise I won't tell. Anyhow, I'm off to enjoy the beach. Don't leave me hanging too long here. Looks like you're more than ready to enjoy the beach. Would you like to head on down there? later <gasps> what's with them talk about killing the vibe hey what's up they're getting some sun too huh yeah just can't help but feel sorry oh, for them you know <gasps> poor bastards ain't Those done nothing to nobody creeps. but we treat them like monsters all the same you're freaking everyone out for real Take a hike. Hey, you leave them alone. <laughs> Thanks for keeping watch. I'll only be a sec. Take your time. Uh, well, the water won't turn off. <laughs> Johnny sure found himself a real fixer-upper. Kinda reminds me of home. Are you almost done? Aerith? Aerith. Are you all right? Tell me, what color would you say this is? None. Thing is, it used to be white. At least, it was back in Midgar. Materia is formed from the life stream itself, orbs infused with knowledge, memories. 
the whispers. They took all that from mine? These memories were precious? Yes. Extremely. Weren't you headed to the beach? Some time with Tifa might lift your spirits. Soak up the sun? Cause I sure am. Uh, yeah. In a sec. Ready. Now, let's find us some resort wear. And then we can finally hit the beach! Yeah. Let's, let's roll. roll. Hang loose! You ladies look like you're on the way down to the water. Uh, if you're in the market for some beach attire, why not participate in Costa del Amor? What's that? A special event that'll make your time here unforgettable! And don't worry, your pet can join too! Well, in that case, sign me up! <laughs> Perfect! Then here's one ticket for the two of you. And one for your doggy. With those tickets of yours, you can run wild on the pet playground, ride around on wheelies, or... There's also the photo contest, and you can't miss the piano recital. So go out there and be sure to have yourself the ball. Hang loose! Hang loose! Hang loose. <laughs> Ready to have some fun? Yeah, let's go. Oh, you taking part in Wheelie Rendezvous? I'm so sorry. We like just stopped our wheelie rentals for the day. You're kidding me. What should we do instead, Tifa? Tifa? You're not from Sector 7, are you? In Midgar? Huh? Yes, I am. Oh, Tifa! My life, my love, nay, my everything! You're not quoting Johnny, are you? What a disappointment. See, I was expecting someone very different. Someone metropolitan and chic who lights up every room she walks into. I have no idea what he sees in you. Um, excuse me? Stow the tood. It's fine. I, uh, I get this all the time. That's some kind of humble brag? Hey, Jenny! Don't just stand there. Go get the unreturned wheelies. Don't tell me what to do. Ugh! How come everyone here thinks they're better than me? I'm just giving you work. Screw this! Quit! Ugh, should have known this would happen. So, you're friends with her, right? Since she quit, would you mind picking up the rest of the wheelies for me? Yeah, sure. We'll do it. You don't have to please everyone you meet. I know, but I still feel like I owe it to Johnny. So I figure maybe if I do this for Jenny, I'll have given him back something. Or maybe I just want peace of mind. I guess. <laughs> Let's get those wheelies. Gosh, God, it's just some dumb wheelies. Why does she care? <sighs> of course Johnny would fall for a girl like her. I've been going about this all wrong, haven't I? Jenny, over here. We brought all the wheelies back for you. <laughs> Stop being so nice. I can't take it. I've decided. I'm going to give up on Johnny. There's no way I could ever compete with you. My way of saying sorry. Take them. There's two cards there, so have fun. Hold up. Thanks, but that's way too generous. What? This one's for you and Johnny. I bet you'll have a more fun together. I think you've got the wrong idea. Johnny and I are just friends, nothing more. For real? But the way he talks about you, I figured you were... You know he likes to exaggerate. True. <laughs> and of course, he also has a habit of getting carried away. I would feel a lot better if he had someone to back him up. Keep him out of trouble. Oh! So you're 
foisting him on me. Is that it? <laughs> Nothing like that. Sorry, forget I said anything. Anyway, thanks for the card. I'm glad we got all this straightened out. Plus, now I know Johnny's a free man. So, I might as well shoot my shot then, huh? See ya! Hello, Tifa. There's a concert scheduled today. Or was, at least. Something came up, you see. The pianist decided to skip town. At least he was kind enough to leave behind a letter. Said he had decided to elope. What? Elope? The heart wants what it wants, and who are we to deny it? However, without a pianist, there can be no concert. These fools called us down here because they thought we knew a replacement. Even between the two of us, it's not like we know everyone in every business. Mm hmm Oh my. These hands. These fingers. <sighs> they have the strength of a warrior's and yet are so very delicate. You've played the piano before. That much is obvious. Yeah. I mean, kind of. I did take some lessons when I was a kid, but that was ages ago. I don't want to hear excuses. I want to hear you playing the goddamn piano. Now tickle the ivory. Thank you so much for performing. Here you are. A companion card and a memento. What we give all our concert goers. Now, as for what we owe you for your performance. <laughs> Allow me to speak for the lady. First, there's the on-call rate. Then, there's my finder's fee. And on top of that... <laughs> I received word from the pianist who eloped. He and his partner left for a place where nothing can come between the two of them ever again. It seems your performance didn't just save the hotel's reputation, it also saved a relationship. <sighs> May the next time we meet be on the stage of the Honeybee Inn. Until then, my liberators of love. Nice touch. I can tell you're just dying to hit the beach right about now. Ready to rock? Do you even have to ask? as a dolphin, and Aerith as diaphanous as a jellyfish. <laughs> that your way of complimenting us? Human beauty is hard for me to assess. Sun. Speaking of which, you guys should probably put on sunscreen. <laughs> you might want to go first. That's some sage advice, Mr. Pasty. <sighs> Make way, people. Back it up. 
What? Hey! Kojo. Oh, what a wonderful surprise it is to see you again. Uh, rest assured, I'm not here for Aerith. Though, were she to offer her assistance, I'd gladly accept. Don't hold your breath. Oh, I won't. At any rate... A very special show is about to start. One starring you, perhaps. Now this <laughs> is so much fun. Hey, Play like to have you your sleep. You Wake up and tell us. <laughs> so what say you? Care to join me in the lab? If you girls sign up with Shinra, you'll be set for life. Wow, this is quite an offer. And as luck would have it, I'm in need of a few female assistants. <laughs> Think about it. You could help give birth to the world's next hero. That would be so cool. Before a hero strikes down his foe, he must strike them with awe at his beauty. But he is not a hero by virtue of innate greatness. Only by inspiring others does he earn the title. Do you follow? It's admittedly a lofty concept. Too lofty for me, but it sounds amazing. There you are, Professor. So glad you could make it. I trust my girls are making you feel welcome. There's nothing sexier than a man in a white coat. Say, Professor, how about I polish those glasses for you? Care to savor some of the local delicacies, Professor? Here, open wide. <laughs> so you heeded the call too, did you? What are you talking about? <laughs> Not consciously, then. As you can see, your brothers down there are having a little get-together. Uh, line him up. Yes, sir. All right. <laughs> Okay, let's move along, sir. This way, and stop. There you go. Mm -hmm. That ought to do it. Don't be shy. What the hell are you playing at? That, my friends, is for me to know, and for you to find out. Oh, 
spoil your comeback? No, you did good. <laughs> that thing's not gonna go down easy. But I've got an idea. Do me a favor. Keep it busy. I did this. This is all my fault. Hey, you! Mr. Mopey! Huh? Over here! Who? Oh, me? <laughs> you want to help him, don't you? Then you'd better hold huh? still! Ah! Huh. Let's wrap this up. We've come so far, but it still feels like Midgar's right behind us. We were his prisoners, me and my mom, Ethalna. He kidnapped us because she was a Cetra, a specimen for his experiments. And after what he did to her, after all the pain and the horror he put us through, I hate him. Sometimes, I imagine the things I'd do to him if I got the chance. I start thinking things so dark and ugly that it scares me. They're just thoughts. Let them be dark and ugly. You are not. You think so? What I'm trying to say is, worry about the future when it comes. You'll know what to do. And whatever you decide, I'm with you. I appreciate it. <laughs> Shall we? Future self. Can't say when you'll meet, but trust me, you'll love her. Just you wait.
couldn't find the bartender, so I, uh, helped myself. Costa del Sol. Used to make them back at the bar. And here I am, drinking one in its namesake. Feels like it's been ages since I mixed a drink. Since Seventh Heaven. Wanna go back? Midgar? I mean, of course. Someday. But I also know I have to move on. At least for now. No telling what the future holds for us. Hey, I can make one for you too, if you want. Nah, uh, I'm good. Next time I ask for a cocktail, it'll be at the new Seventh Heaven. At least, that's what I promised Barrett. And when exactly did you promise him that? Sometime. All right, Mr. Secretive. You do you. Hate to say it, but that girl really came through for us back there. Unlike me, I couldn't do a damn thing for those poor bastards. You tried. That's all you can do. And all that matters if you ask me. <laughs> you? Trying to cheer me up? Now I've seen everything. Hey, you ready to leave? are fun in the sun. Yeah, no fun ain't the word I'd use. So, back to the hotel? Johnny's famous sea smell in. You see, a few kind girls who saw what happened on the beach gave me the lowdown. On the hotel and Mayor Capono. Ugh, I'm a moron. How could I be so blind? You borrowed a lot of money from him, right? Will you be able to pay it back? So... The girls told Capono, keep leeching off our hero and we'll smear your name so bad Shinra will kick you to the curb. And the crazy thing is, it worked. He caved. I am footloose and dead free, baby. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> Johnny, the local hero. Proprietor of the Seaside Inn, soon to be Seven Star Resort Hotel. Now that would be something. You know you gotta get one star before you can get the other six, right? <laughs> <laughs> Very funny, but I got plans! Ow! 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 Well, good for you. <laughs> uh, you okay there? Great. Now watch him fall up the stairs. <laughs> Thanks for everything. Nah, I should be the one thanking you. Anyway, what's next for you guys? Gotta follow some ropes. Oh, those dudes shuffled off toward Mount Corel this morning. Tried to get the injured ones to stay till they were healthy, but... Corel, huh? Corel it is. Be safe, you guys. Wouldn't want anything to happen to my inaugural guests. Bon voyage. As the phoenix rises from the ashes, so too shall my hotel rise from obscurity. Ah, uh, hello! 
Aren't you all forgetting about someone? And... Action! Some know me as the world's greatest materia hunter. Others, an unstoppable assassin. And the rest, a benevolent and beautiful ninja. But who am I truly? Bootai's White Rose, the one and only Yuffie! You spiky haired jerk face! Where do you think you're going? I challenge you to a duel! If I win, you get the honor of serving yours truly. However, if you manage to somehow fluke your way to victory, this amazing ninja will agree to join you. <laughs> what do you say? have to fight. That is, unless you really want to. Oh, abort, abort! Tactical retreat! <sighs> the hell is her deal? You try anything funny, anything. I'll shove you in the sister ray, point it at Wu-Tai, and blast you back home. Yeesh. But I hear ya. Ooh. <laughs> you won't regret this, or my name isn't Yuffie Kisaragi. <laughs> okay, let's see over here, and... <laughs> Out of service. So we've got to walk? Uh, you'll be fine. Fresh air, nice view. The view ain't all that. Not unless you enjoy staring at ruined reactors. <sighs> right. You grew up around here, didn't you? <sighs> Let's get a move on. Hey, Cloud! Materia's like super condensed Mako or something, right? So? So? That means wherever we find Mako, we'll find Materia too! <laughs> Alright, timeout's over, team. Let's go! I think Aerith might need a break. Sorry. My legs are killing me. <sighs> Let's rest here. But if we stop now, the Materia... I mean, the mystery men might slip away. Hey, I know what to do. I'll go on ahead and scout the area for us. You guys can catch up later. Well, see ya. <laughs> catch up later, my ass. <sighs> I think I'd better go keep an eye on them. Barrett's not himself right now, you know? I know. Take your time, okay? No need to rush. Thanks. Will do. Come on, out you go. Again? Well, look who it is. <clears throat> you here to pick a fight? What? Oh, <laughs> no. Just dropping off some unruly passengers. They were fine when we left Junon. And then they weren't. So, here we are. Don't know why. One minute they were okay, and the next... Eh, whatever. This is way above my pay grade. So, that's it? Well, since you're here... Stay in chat, but Rudy. 
and I are busy people. She'll be more than happy to keep you company, though. Now play nice, shitbirds. You're done. Any last words? Guess the Turks are back on duty, huh? Wish they'd all go on vacation. For real. Come on. We need to find the others.
Yeah? Let me in. <laughs> 